today is a day that we kind of put the emphasis point on a smart place, Huntsville a smart place. Uh, if you notice my little badge right here, that's what we uh, brand ourselves as, Huntsville a smart place. And today we're going to be able to um, honor uh, Bill Emrich. And Bill, thank you for all that you've done. Uh, and be able to honor him for something that he has done that uh, puts a new meaning into space exploration and going uh, in, back into deep space where, uh, where man should be, and man should be at some point. Usually I don't read proclamations, but I think this one is very important to read because it gives you the essence of what all has happened here. Uh, the City of Huntsville, Alabama proclamation in honor of Dr. William J. Emrich upon his selection as the 2015 American Institute of Astronautics and Aeronautics AIAA Engineer of the Year, which is a huge honor. Uh, whereas Dr. William Emrich is a NASA engineer and a part-time fission propulsion lecturer at the University of Alabama in Huntsville Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering Department, and whereas as a NASA engineer, Dr. Emrich is the project manager and lead investigator for the megawatt class nuclear thermal rocket element environmental simulator, NTREES, say that five times in a row. <laughs> <laughs> and whereas as a part-time lecturer, he petitioned UAH to support the teaching of a course on nuclear rocket propulsion in the MA, uh, MAE department that helps train young engineers to make significant contributions to the nuclear propulsion field and whereas Dr. Emrich's class has grown in popularity over time and is taught every other spring semester, his class currently uses a draft textbook he is processing, he is in the process of publishing as no other books have been written since the 1950s. Congratulations. <laughs> you know, you're, you're covering a lot, big span there. Uh, and whereas Dr. Emrich's research in nuclear fuels is opening a new world for rockets to travel in space faster, cheaper, and less dangerous, and whereas as a result of his groundbreaking research, Dr. Emrich will receive the American Institute of Astronautics and Aeronautics Engineer of the Year Award for his work in the nuclear thermal rocket propulsion at the AIAA Propulsion and Energy Forum and Exposition July 27th through July 29th in Orlando, Florida. Only one such award is made each year. Now, therefore, I, Tommy Battle, Mayor of the City of Huntsville, do hereby designate July 27, 2015, the day that he will get his award, as Dr. William J. Emrich Day in the City of Huntsville, and commend his outstanding efforts in advanced propulsion research that has enabled deep space exploration. Dr. Emrich, would you please come forward? <laughs> I would really like to say, you know, this is, um, is one, one of the most important things we can do. And, and from coming from NASA, uh, coming from Marshall Space Flight Center, coming from Huntsville, Alabama, you know, we've been, you know, we, we've done the, the gamut. We've started off in space exploration, sending a man up into low Earth orbit. Uh, we sent a man into deep space and sent him to the moon. And more, uh, even, even better, we brought him back. Uh, and then we've learned how to live in space because we said the next journey that we take is going to be a long journey. So it's been a progression as we come through and we've learned to live in low earth orbit. But now we've got to learn the lessons of going back into deep space again. And if we're going to go, whether we go capture an asteroid, whether we go to Mars, whether we go to Pluto, wherever we go, we're going to have to get there faster and quicker. And we're going to have to find a way to get there uh, and, and get there faster, quicker so we can get back. And, uh, and we can learn the lessons that need to be learned from deep space exploration. And Dr. Emrich has, uh, has given us one of those ways to do that. So I would like to turn it over to you and say thank you very much. Uh, you make us proud being from Huntsville, Alabama, but even more proud just being an American and bringing forth this technology to the world. Thank you. Thank you, Kevin. Um, thank you, Mr. Mayor, for uh, for your kind words and this great honor uh, which you do for me today. Um, how the Lord has really blessed me in that I'm able to do the work which I really love to do. I've actually wanted to work on nuclear rocket engines uh, since I was a kid in high school. Um, I, uh, that was when I first learned uh, of the nuclear rocket work being done uh, in the United States uh, and this was back in the 1960s so uh, deja vu all over again. Uh, Anyway, with, uh, with that thought in mind, I uh, directed uh, my education in college 
uh, with the thought that uh, someday I would be able to work on nuclear propulsion systems. Uh, how great it is that I'm actually able to do what I wanted to do as a kid. Uh, how many people get to do that? Uh, uh, that being said, uh, none of it could have happened without the tremendous support that I've received from the wonderful people here in Huntsville. Uh, the management in Marshall has been behind me all the way and have been uh, so extremely encouraging and helpful in uh, removing obstacles which uh, have come along from time to time. Um, my uh, engineering colleagues have also been extremely helpful in uh, offering wise and innovative suggestions on how the facility could be made better. And um, uh, I've also been blessed to be able to teach at the University of Alabama in Huntsville. It's uh, such a wonderful thing to see uh, new uh, students, uh, kids coming along, and the excitement they have about space travel and uh, uh, all that that entails. Uh, <clears throat> my family, uh, especially my wife, a lady, has been uh, gracious to put up with me and endlessly hear about the work I do at NASA. Uh, they deserve a medal themselves. Uh, uh, but to uh, receive this honor now, uh, no less in Huntsville, the Rocket City, is just the icing on the cake. Uh, thank you all again for this most amazing and wonderful honor that you've given me this day. Appreciate it.